Hello, fellow engineers, and welcome to Underminer, a free little mining game I found. That's super, super fun. All right, so basically, you start off in this mining rig. You can you can turn the, the drill on manually, or you can just have it running the whole time. But basically, as we drill down, we're looking for copper ores. Oh, there's one. So as we mine into this ore strip, you'll see our, our green bar, our inventory is going up. We can only hold 100 kilos at the moment. But of course, we can upgrade our mining rig to drill faster to hold more resource all that good stuff uh, so anyway if we just snake down trying to stay in the ore and you'll see we are we are running out of fuel but also our drill is getting a bit blunt we're down to 55 percent on that uh, thankfully ahead of us is some fuel so let's pick that up not really sure how that got down here but i'm not going to ask questions but uh, we're going to be returning to surface to upgrade our rig at some point soon probably when my drill my drill sharpness runs out, which looks very soon. Although, look at that. So if we head over this way, this will repair our drill. So if we want to, we can we can go and make that sharpen out. Uh, for now, though, I think we're just going to... Let's just drill in here. You can see <laughs> the game's like, yo, your drill's about to explode. Actually, what happens if I just go to the end? Oh, it just takes me back to the shop. Cool. So anyway, in here, I can upgrade various parts of my drill. So if I start with the drill bit... I can level this up. It's only going to cost me 500 quid. Really? Thankfully, because of all those resources I got, I've got 15,000. So we can definitely get that. I've now ranked up to an amateur miner as well. Now that increases the, the sort of level cap as well as how many missiles I can hold. There's missiles. Yes, in the shop there are missiles. They're seven and a half grand though. I don't think I'm going to waste any time on that, to be honest. Hopefully, I might just stumble across them. I think for now, I might I might increase my my body. Yeah, that increases my durability, so that's good. And then my engine, what does that do? That increases... Oh, my max fuel. Yeah, we'll level up all of those. All right, then we head back underground, and uh, we start up the top. And because our hole is already dug, we can get through this by using, like, really minimal fuel. Because uh, my drill bit is not running. So this is awesome. I can also boost as well if I want to go really fast. But again, that does use up more fuel. Uh, from this point though, I'm going to head over that way. Because look, there's there's a different copper ore over there. So let's drill through all of this. And then, oh look, up there. There's another one up there as well. But basically, the more ore I get, the, the more money I'll have, the more upgrades I can do. Oh, and look, there's some fuel down there. And we'll go down, we'll grab a tiny bit of iron. And then we're back into some copper. We'll mine all of this out. The game does want me to go down. Apparently, there's like a little, there's an emerald cave. So we've got to drop 400 meters. Uh, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be going via all the, all the ore though. This yummy, yummy ore. Get in my belly. This is a harder type of soil, so it splits in my fuel and my durability. But it uh, looks like we're pretty close to the cave. I tell you what, let's do, let's do a cheeky repair, and then I can pick up that repair. And we can get back into this. Try and head into this copper ore. We are filling up. That is my, my main concern at the moment. We're 75 kilos of a 100 kilo limit. Let's say what. Let's just go like straight and try and find this cave. Looking at the map in the top right, I think it is just like this direction. So we'll head over here. Oh, what are they? Mine emeralds. Are they emeralds? I thought emeralds were green. So if we go and mine that. Ah, that's ah, harmful. Ow. Ow, get away from it. Ow, that hurt. I, I imagine that these green things are emeralds. So if we go into these. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Do some sweeping mining. That's it. So that is all the emerald. So I'll go back and mine every every last drop of it. Don't want to leave any emerald behind. Now, that is the good thing about this mining ship. It does actually move quite, quite nicely. You can turn on the spot pretty well. So if we go back to the menu, we can hold G to return to base. Return. Doesn't sound right to me. So we will do that. And you can see we made 13 grand there. Uh, worth noting, the emeralds, they're not actually... You don't sell them. They are actually resources we can use to upgrade. So the only money came from the iron and the copper. Important to remember. Uh, we got 390 meters under the ground there. Are you blind? Are you blind? Let's have a look at what we can upgrade. Let's have a look at the body. So if we upgrade this, oh, it increases not only durability, but also the weight limit. But since I like to drill and get all the resources, I think that's probably the upgrade for me. I think everything else costs 10,000. Yeah, so I can't afford any of those. Now, there is also a shop where you can buy like, you can buy these upgrades. And basically, you can add these, these equipment. Each part of our drill has an equipment slot, so we can add those in, which should make our make our mining ship a lot better. 
Anyway, for now, we're back at the top. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna head over this way because there's there's another copper ore there. There's also one over to the very left, so I'll get that one next time. And also these these little quests you can see get to the cave that's two and a half kilometers underground. Uh, they will also get us some resource as well. Oh, and look, what is that down there? I think it's a treasure map. So we'll go grab that. It is a treasure map. Displays the location of treasure boxes. Ooh. So now we have a little blue HUD icon. So if we try and head towards that, we should find some treasure. I don't know why I said that in a West Country accent then. Oh, and by the way, my inventory increased by 50%. It went up by 50 kilos. All right, anyway, we're down into a bit of a bit of iron. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna go off grid a bit because if we head over this way, this is where the treasure is. Aha! Did you see that? We just we just uncovered it. So if I just turn around and head back up there, there you go F. We got a processor. Overall 71. So it consumes durability and fuel to significantly increase item efficiency. So if we go back to the shop and equip that, I think as we as we go through resource like this through the ore, we should get more. Uh, but it costs it costs fuel and durability, remember. So it's not perfect. Anyway, turn the turn, turn the drill bit off. Let's head down here. I'm gonna boost as well because I'm impatient. So we round this corner. Oh, S bend out. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to head over this way and get... Yes, we are in the hard stuff now, but I'm going to go get some iron. We'll drill through all this. I don't know, actually, whether my fuel completely fills my fills my fuel bar or not. But uh, I'm going to wait till I'm basically out of fuel before I try and give that a go. Anyway, down here, there's another little bit of iron. Oh, yeah, this is one that we cut across before. So this time, I'll stay in the ore patch. Uh, judging by how fast my inventory is filling up, I'm not sure we're going to make the cave this time. I think I'm better off upgrading, making my ship way better before we do any of that. Yummy, yummy iron. And then we've got 20 kilos remaining. And oh, no. There's gold. I found gold. Oh, I'll tell you what. I may want to do my upgrade first. If I get that processor connected. Yeah, I'll tell you what. I'm going to go. Seems a little bit backwards. But if I just get the copper this time, I can get the gold next time. We then reach run to base camp. And oh, to be fair, gold isn't worth that much more than iron. It's worth 150 compared to 90. Good to know. But yeah, in the upgrades, yes, in our in our in our body, we can now add this module. So that gives item efficiency plus three. So we'll wang that in. And then I got 33 grand to level stuff up. I'll tell you what, 15 grand to upgrade this again to give us more more weight limit. I think I'm gonna do that. So level that up. To level it up again. Oh, the body changes style. Ooh, nice. That costs 20 grand though. I've only got 18. If I were to upgrade, oh yeah, look, I can upgrade the max speed. 10 grand. Yeah, let's do that. And let's see how much faster it is. Oh, it's way faster. It's so much faster. I'm not even boosting. Like if I boost, look how fast we are. Oh man, it's quite hard to steer out. That's a sharp corner. Anyway, I've made it down to here. So let's get our drill back on. Oh, it even drills faster as well. But yeah, I'll get through this iron since we're here. But I, my main aim is to get down to that, down to the gold. So we'll get into here. We are now in the, the hard area. We're using a lot of fuel, I've noticed. Oh, have we come out? Oh, we've come out of the emeralds. Okay, this time then, we'll just mine a load of emerald. Um, oh, look over that way by the fuel. There's, there's a treasure map. So let's just mine all of this emerald. We're doing a nice sweeping pattern, which I'm sure is possible in these drills in real life. But we just want to make sure we don't leave any emerald behind. So that's all that mine. That looks very strong shape-esque. But uh, let's go in here, get the treasure map. Boosh. So there's treasure back in the other direction. I'm going to use my fuel up just so I can pick up that fuel. Uh, it did seem to fill up all the way. Um, but yeah, then I'm going to come up this way. Spin her around. Three point turn. Definitely no more than three. And then, oh, is that a missile? So we pick that up. Yes, we now have a missile, which means I can do things like boosh. Boosh. Oh, man. <laughs> wow. As you can tell by my Mario sound, I was quite impressed with that. So <laughs> we can come down. We can get all those emeralds. Now, I love that it actually turns them into emeralds and you still got to like pick them up. But yeah, we'll pick all those up. We'll grab all of these emeralds as well. Nice. And then we'll be on our way over here where... Oh, look, there's even more emeralds. Who'd have thought it? Oh, and then down below, there's more gold. So for now, that's all of those. We're only 70 meters away from the treasure. I'm going to head over to that. That is just through these bits of emerald. So it should be there. Yeah, there it is. So give that a go. It's a lightweight drill part. Look at the resolution. <laughs> Increases drill speed and drill durability 
got it. Ooh, reduces the drill size. Interesting. Anyway, for now, let's just grab all the emeralds whilst we're here. Because we are going to need emeralds to level up our, our equipment like late game. So that's all that done. Inventory pretty much full. Uh, we still made 16 grand though. So not a bad day in the office. I think I'm going to upgrade my, my drill attack. So that gives it an extra one for 10 grand. So level it up again. Our drill attack and mining efficiency. Yes, that is worthwhile. 15 grand spent. And then do I add this equipment? It makes it smaller, but it's more efficient. Yeah, let's try it out. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, no, it is smaller. Look how small it is. I'm used to having such a big one, and now it's tiny. Right, anyway, because it's smaller, it does make driving a little bit quicker. So we can get down, hopefully, to that gold way quicker. Although my impatience using the boost has burnt through half my fuel. But we have finally arrived at the gold. So let's get this on. Because we've got extra mining efficiency, this should be pretty good. I'm just worried we are leaving quite a bit of gold, like, on the sides. Oh, so, yeah, I'm not sure I like this drill. I'm not sure I like it. It's a bit small. But yeah, we'll grab all the gold that we can. And then, oh, what does this go into? A new layer? Yeah, a shale stratum. Still, there's loads of gold in here, so we'll grab all of that. Thankfully, I did increase my drill last time I was up there. So, we should have, should have all right drill strength. I'll go grab this gold i can see some some dangerous minerals over there does that mean there's yes emeralds nearby anyway we're getting the the red screen of death because our fuel's nearly out so we're, we're down to seven fuel so if i refuel does it fill to the top oh no it doesn't oh that's annoying so we will run out of fuel very shortly i'm gonna grab this though oh there's a treasure map over to the left so once i've mined out these emeralds i'll go get this treasure map so there's treasure down below Still, for now, distracted by the shiny green stuff. So we've mined all of that out. We'll then head down this way where... Ooh, are they rubies? I think we got some rubies. Yes, rubies. Ruby, 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 ruby. Ah. Anyway, let's head down. Oh, yes, there's some fuel over there. Decent. So we'll grab that. Now, I am then going to refuel, and then I'm going to use my repair tool as well to get that up. Probably worth getting the rubies over this side. I feel like rubies are more valuable than emeralds at this point. Now, over this way is another repair thing, though. So, I will grab that. Let's go grab the treasure chest. Oh, there's also... Oh, look. So, there's a missile. And I think that wall, I've got to, like, missile it. Let's just grab this Grab this treasure chest first. Ooh, a blurry barrel. Durability increases significantly and fuel drops slightly. Okay. Anyway, if I stand back a bit, I think we can we can blast these walls down. And look, there's a man down there. So maybe he will help us. Boosh. Oh, <laughs> probably should have told him to uh, take cover before I did that. Anyway, hang on. Let's turn, my, let's turn my drill off just so I don't drill him in the face. But we've now ranked up. We can hold loads more stuff. We can level up more and etc. And we've saved Jimmy. He looks like he's been down here for a long time. What year is it? My lover MJ is waiting for me in the glacial area. Could you deliver this letter for me? Okay, we've got to give Michael Jackson a letter. So I guess now we've got the letter. We don't actually need Jimmy anymore. So see you later, Jimmy. Eat drill. Boosh. Oh, I can't actually go. I can't go any deeper. Anyway, just going to fill up my inventory with the red stuff. Then return to base camp. And we made 18 grand. That was all from the gold. So we've got just under 50 grand to spend. And if you look now, as we if we want to level up our drill, it costs 20 grand as well as some of those emeralds. Uh, finally, though, we get increased drill size. So yes, definitely do that. What is it to level up again? Mining efficiency and drill attack, 25 grand. I think I'm going to do it. Um, oh, it's actually, it looks different as well. Oh, we got an extra slot. Speaking of equipment slots, if we go to our to our engine module, we can add durability or this one, high capacity battery, increase our fuel and fuel efficiency at the cost of max speed. I think I'm going to take that one, to be honest. Anyway, so we start off right back up the top. Oh, look at our shiny new drill, though. It's so shiny. Anyway, we'll mine straight down. And yes, we found some gold already. And oh, man, this thing is drilling fast. We are, we are absolutely creaming it through this. Decent. There's more gold beneath me as well, so we'll get that. And we're heading towards the, the glacial area where hopefully we'll find Michael Jackson. That's a very random character to have in this game. Anyway, let's go through here. We've got one of those which we can pick up. Repair. Thank you. Just keep going through the gold. How's the inventory looking? It's half full or half empty if you're a pessimist. Ah, oh, some more fuel there. So I will just refuel. Boosh. And then pick that up. And we'll continue through the gold. 
which there's a lot of it. We've nearly filled up our inventory again. I mean, it is now full. There's the glacial area, though. Okay, I think back to the surface, sell all this, and we'll get back to the same spot. Uh, made 49 grand there, by the way. So cheeky upgrade of my body for 20 grand. Look, it's now it's now yellow. Then we'll do the engine as well. Level up. Then another level up. Can we afford? No, 20 grand. Oh, we're just two grand short. Ooh, it's a big old copper thing. Right, hang on. Hang on a second. Because I saw up here there was a missile. Look, there it is. So if we grab the missile, F. Then if we aim down and go, boosh. Then, oh, I missed all of it. <laughs> we shot too far. But yeah, I can then pick up all that copper, which I'm not going to complain about. Grab this fuel as well. All right, then go back to my shaft. Yes, we're making depth. We are making depth. Oh, there's another missile. Oh, and a treasure map. So we'll grab that. Treasure map is straight down. So right, there it is. There it is. What have we got? Another blurry barrel. Durability drops slightly and fuel increases significantly. Which, to be fair, could be useful because I haven't really been drilling through ore. I haven't used much durability, but I've used a lot of fuel if you look at my bars. Anyway, from this point, I found some gold. So I'm going to head through the gold. But annoyingly, it looks like I'm going to fill up my inventory again. Oh, look, I got a missile. I've got a missile. And there's there's a load of gold to the right. I might save that for next time. I don't have that much inventory space left. So for now, let's just blast through here. There is the glacial area. Oh, and a new resource. What is that? It's blue. Antarctica. Cool. All right, there's also a treasure map here as well. So I will grab that. So whilst I'm here, let's just drill, drill a hole. Try and get to the treasure if we can. So yes, here is treasure. Oh, look, it's a white chest. And inside, overloaded containers. Increase inventory weight, but reduce fuel efficiency. Okay. Uh, I'm going to keep going down. Maybe I can do the letter whilst I'm here. I don't want to go into the ore, because that'll be a big waste. But, ah, oh, yes, look. Here's Michael Jackson during their ginger hair phase. All right, here's MJ. We give him the letter. Oh, she wants me to take a letter back to Jimmy. Ugh. She gave me 20 emeralds. I'm not sure that was worth it, if I'm honest. Anyway, we go back to the surface. We made 44 grand there. Not as much as last time because I filled up my inventory with iron and copper. But I look how much that new Antarctica is worth. 225. Oh, Jimmy's back at the surface. So we don't have to go find him again. Good. He's just told us there's a legendary mineral down there. So we'll go find that in a bit. But for now, I've got 92 grand to upgrade my stuff. So to level up my drill. Oh, no. I need some of that mineral. I think that's in the Antarctic area. Okay, in the meantime, can I level up? anything else i can level up this durability and item efficiency yes please yeah, my extra slot let's shove that in so that increases my weight limit which is good and then i'll level up the the engine oh look it's all yellow and shiny now so I level that up a few times we now have extra slots so do i want durability or do i want fuel i think i want fuel don't i so let's grab the mixture alpha in there and then let's start at the very top again. Now, this time, I should have my straight down path. So if I literally just follow this down. Oh, yeah, this is so much better. Look, we're hardly using any fuel because I don't have to use my, my drill. And we are flying. Beautiful. All right, so anyway, we're back in the, in the glacial area. So let's grab all of this mineral. This was worth way more. And then we'll keep an eye out for the new, like, the new gems. So we'll follow this around. It is a big spiral. Yay. So we have mined all of that. The trouble is we're, we've, we're nearly full on the old inventory. Um, and I haven't found I haven't found those, those gems yet. So I think let's try and ignore all the ore for now and just get some new gems. So down here, I, I did a little bit of exploring last time. There was there was the sapphires. There was some emeralds. All right. So down here we have... Oh, we have a... Oh, there's the gems. All right. Boosh. Get rid of the wall. And then we can get these gems... Diamond. Oh, they're diamonds. So yeah, if I want to upgrade anything, I need as many diamonds as I can. Oh, in the bottom right, there's a treasure chest as well. Oh, we're in the horn blend stratum. This stuff is hard to drill through. It is very slow. Oh. Anyway, there's a treasure map. So there is treasure down beneath us. Now I'm going to try and get the treasure chest just while I'm here. There's the guy that's going to tell us about the, the, legendary, the legendary resource. You right, mate? All right, so he needs me to mine emeralds and rubies. Question is, if my inventory's full, can I can I do that? Or is the game going to say no? Let's see what happens. So our ruby... Yes, rubies are going up. Okay, so we're good. We've ranked up. Oh, and Dr. Charles has given us a teleportation device. Yes. Okay, before, before I return to the surface, I am going to try and get this treasure chest down it. So it's right here. There we go. Was it worth getting? Torn up items user guide. Increases efficiency of fuel and items. Oh, no negative effect. 
decent. So we'll return to the base camp once again. We made 87 grand. That blue stuff is worth so much. All right, so now we can upgrade this thing. I reckon it's got to be just keep doing the body. I feel like the body is like the best upgrade. So 40 grand. Man, that is expensive. This next one, 50 grand. I can't afford to do it though. Oh, and will it be will it be a green and black body? Ooh, nice. Yeah, we can now teleport, presumably to the bottom. Oh, yes. Sick. And look, we can hold 500 kilos worth of resources now. So that is fantastic. Yeah, since durability is going down very fast, let me just grab that. Thank you. And then, oh, is this a new resource? This could be worth money. What is it? It's sapphires. Just ores of sapphire. That's insane. So yeah, we'll get as many sapphires as we can. May as well fill up the inventory. Now we've got the teleport. I'm not that much in a rush to get down deeper anymore. Oh, oh, what's that? Is that like a lava layer? Can I drill through that? And yeah, let me repair first. Right, let's see. Can we drill through? Oh, we can. And there's purple lava area. What is the purple stuff? Amethyst. My ship is not in a good place, though, so let's let's regen our health. I don't know how much further we're going to be able to get because that durability is going down fast. And then, oh, to the right, I think that's the radio we've got to look for. So we'll drill over to this. I found the radio. Now we've got to head 3,450 meters underground. Well, and thankfully, there is, a, there is a repair thing here, so we'll grab that. We will do a cheeky repair, and then we're just 350 meters away. Hopefully, we can get there before we explode. Right, oh, we're into another layer. This is going to be tough on the old durability. And Oh, we found titanium. There's so much resource down here. So yeah, we're going through the titanium. I don't have any repair modules left, though, so we may we may have to return to the surface. I've also I've hit my... I've hit my inventory. Yeah, I think this is this is a lost cause now. Quick, return, return. We made 200 grand. <laughs> so let's upgrade my drill bit. So upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Oh my goodness, what is that? We've got an anchor at the front now. They're also worth noting, I'm sort of out of out of rubies. So I may want to mine some more of them. For now though, let's teleport. Oh, look at it. When you turn it on, look at that. That is sick. Right, anyway, as before, I might just do like a straight down sort of drill. I uh, forgot to see like, what titanium was worth, but I'll, I'll go straight down to it. This drill is really fat now. Right, there it is. There it is. All right, we found someone. We also found a treasure chest. Excessively large drill equipment. <laughs> so back up the surface, we got 200 grand. Uh, we rescued this woman called Sophie. She, apparently, we nursed her back to health. That's a healthy face. Uh, but she knows where the legendary mineral is. So before we do that, let's upgrade our engine. So level that up. We've got an extra slot now. Let's shove the new engine equipment in it. Nice. We can shove our excessively large drill bit on there. Oh, my drill's even bigger now, so I don't fit through any of my holes. Yeah, look, we are scraping the sides. <laughs> oh, this thing is girthy. I'll tell you what, though, to upgrade, I do need some rubies. So let's just go grab these. Nice, more rubies. Thank you. All right, and then we're deeper than we've been before. There's a village down here, apparently. Oh, yeah, here it is. The underground village. Is everyone, like, dead? They're all, like, just sleeping, are they? All right, this guy wants 10 diamonds to open the door. So I did that. The door is open, which means we can drill down, boost through that door, boost. And then, oh, look at all these emeralds, rubies, diamonds, which means I can upgrade my drill bit even further. Oh, it's max level. We've maxed it out. Yes. Can we max out the body? Yes, body is maxed out. And then we, we fall all the way down. All right, then we're back in here. Now, I could fill up my inventory here. I think what I'm going to do instead, though, if I just shoot a missile, we can go beneath and see what's down here instead. So, boosh, missile, blow up that door, and then, oh, the ancient shelter. All right, so what have we got here? Oh, look, what is that? Break the wall with a missile. Boosh, done it. So, this is the... Ow, ow, it's harmful. Ow. Oh, but it's uranium. Oh, we are mining it. It's rinsing my fuel. Let's regen my fuel, heal as well. Oh, look at it, just rinsing through my fuel. So keep refueling. That is it, though. What is uranium worth? 3,000. Titanium was worth 750, by the way. But uranium is where it's at, which means I can now max out everything. Ooh, I've also got an illegally modified drill equipment. So that increases the drill size even more. Yes, please. <laughs> All right, so how big is... Oh, my God. Look at the size of my drill. You can't tell me you've seen one that big before. All right, so we're back down here. There is a pipe. Do I need to, like, shoot that? Boosh. 
Oh, no, it went straight past. Oh, that's how you get the uranium. You blow it up with missiles. Okay, that makes sense. Boosh. Blow it up. Then pick it up safely without dying. All right, anyway, I've got 750 kilos of it now. <laughs> I literally can't move. Look at me. I've never been this full. That gave us 737 grand. All right, I've got a million quid. I've got nothing to spend it on. I'm just going to, like, completely max out everything. So just buy all that stuff just because I can. All right, then I'm going to go 1,500 meters down. So I'll just do that quick. Just explode all the uranium out the way. Yeah, oh, oh, there's, like, a heart in it. What the hell? Eat missile heart. Boosh. <laughs> Boosh. Am I trying to free the heart or destroy the heart? Oh, no, I've made an earthquake. Thank you for playing. <laughs> that was a random end. Well, considering that was a free game, that was awesome. Definitely recommend that. Anyway, for now, I'll say peace, love, and mining the earth in half. Bye, guys.